Hey everybody, welcome back to Planet Coaster. I have limited the number of guests in this park. Why? Uh, not because of performance or anything. Like, I'm still getting, well, I think I'm getting more frames now than I was. We've lost like 2,000 guests. But when loading the park, it takes longer than I want it to. And I think guests might contribute to that more than, you know, all the rides. So we'll see what happens the next time I load the park. Because I was sat here for like, I don't know, two minutes. It's too long. <laughs> It sounds so, so bad when I put it that way. It's like, oh, I can't even wait two minutes. No, it took longer than I thought it should, so. <laughs> there we go. Solve that problem. Plus, that should take out some of these idiots complaining about stupid things like, no, the stats have gotten worse. Okay, that's fine. I don't care. If I had it my way, I'd kick everyone out. Anyway, uh, did I name this thing? I didn't name the Giga Coaster. Did I forget to look? I think I glanced at the names. I didn't see any, but then again, I didn't really look too hard. So you can still name the Giga Coaster. That is an option to do because it doesn't have a name. What am I doing this episode? I have no idea. Should I build another roller coaster? Probably. It's kind of the whole point of the park. But we're running out of room, which is pretty cool. <laughs> we have a spot here, and then we have room over here. And then, of course, I can always just try to cram other coasters within all these other coasters. Like, I have been doing it. Look at this mess. Let's count how many coasters are on my screen right now. We have one, two, three, four, five? There's five roller coasters on my screen right now, at least. It's kind of hard to tell because they're all relatively the same colors. <laughs> it's amazing. Uh, what coaster should I start? Let's see. We want to go to filters, source, we want Steam Workshop only. Uh, we want ones that have donuts in them, not a cute park. A cute park was the last one. Dungeon Donut, what is this? Have I added this? I have not added this. This, this is different. Okay, look at that. It has a entrance and an exit. It's a castle. Ride name. All right, this was made by... Alyssa B, dive coaster for our supreme almighty lord, the honorable king Donut. Well, I'm putting this thing in then. <laughs> Sweet, it's it was a one that I haven't added before. Brand new coaster. Let's do it. First pick, lucky pick. Where am I gonna put this thing though? Is the question. I think I'm just gonna put it on this side of the park. If I can fill in this side of the park, then we'll fill in the other side of the park. I think that's kind of what I'm going for. So, here we go. Let's have it facing the donut. That'll make my life easier, I think, in the long run. Edit track. And I remember this thing, yes, having a very steep chain hill, which is great. Do that. Spam that a bunch. That should be tall enough. And we're going right for King Donut. Now, this is a very wide vehicle. So, 14 miles per hour already. I don't even have to change it. Oh, right, because it could do the dive thingy. Do we want to do the dive thingy? Ready for this? It's gonna be the best dive coaster ever. We, <laughs> we have to watch out for the gig coaster. Also, <gasps> supports. Have I been turning the supports off? I can't remember the last time I turned supports off. I think they've all just been off already. Hmm. Or maybe I have been doing it. I literally can't remember. Goodbye, supports. Get out of here. Okay. So, this thing. How do I want to do this? We can't do that because, like I said, it's a very fat car, so that would cause some problems. It would be nice if I could just have this thing at the end of the chain hill, but no, it's just dumb. It's all, like, gotta be dumb. Unless I do something like, hold on. We have a very skinny piece of track. Ah, there we go. I think that might do it. We need a start test just to make sure. I'm pretty sure it's going to clear that. I'm fairly certain. I believe. I don't sound so sure, do I? It's because I'm not. <laughs> nah, that'll be fine. That's perfect. I don't know how much speed it's going to have through here. Probably not much. It's not that crazy of a drop. We can do like a little hill. Um, and then we're probably gonna need to bank it a little bit. Is this thing testing? Yeah, okay, there it goes. Okay. It gets frozen there. And then the drop. 50 miles an hour. First hill. 
Oh, those people are so dead. Huh, bounced right over them, but the explosion is going to tag them, watch. <laughs> oh, man, just watching them flip. I want to make a game where it's just, that's the point of it. Yeah, build a roller coaster, and the goal is to just throw the cars at your guests to see uh, how far you can send them. That'll be a great game. <laughs> I'd play it. Okay, you know what? We're just going to go right up to the middle here. Why? Should we do that? Or should we go out this way? I don't know. I kind of like how, you know, if it comes in on this side, it goes out that side and this side that side. I don't want to... I feel like if I go the other way, you know, it's just going to make things look gross. This way, it's more organized. Uh. <laughs> Got him! <laughs> so they roll down the steps. Um, look at all these people. Now they're stuck under the path. What is this dude wearing? Look at those shorts. There's like, ah, uh, yes, I'm going to wear some orange shorts with like bright green cars on them. What are you, five years old? Idiot. It looks like a bathing suit. Anyway, he just really likes the movie cars. So we're going to go down this way and see what happens here. It's a lot of track, but, you know, that's fine. I've been preparing for things like this. Lots of track in the way. Bring that this way. Okay. Oops, too far. What a great ride. I don't know how I feel about this one. I mean, technically, they all kind of start this way. Yeah, I just went right through the middle, because like I've mentioned a bunch of times, we're going to run out of space around here before we ever run out of room in the middle of King Donut. I could have gotten, like, all these coasters, like, crammed into this tiny little area. Because it's not that challenging to do. <laughs> There's so much room in the middle of there, it's crazy. All right, Cobra Roll. I didn't even mean to click that. I just accidentally clicked that. It's a sign. The sign that I need to add a cobra roll. If I can get this to work, it looks really small, and it probably won't work, but if it does... Also, th what is this? Let's see what the ride says. So it goes up. We got good numbers. <laughs> hey, look, we got bad numbers. Okay, yeah, no, that's... Let's, let's change that. <laughs> I think I saw 15 in there. Could this work? Could this possibly work? It'll go around there. Okay, yep. Oh, we may have a problem right here. And right there. Did that fix it? I'm doing it. Oh my god, this works. And we're gonna smooth this because, let's face it, it's kind of repulsive. It's still kind of gross. It's not smoothing the way I want it to. I guess I want the banking smooth, but... That's as smooth as it's gonna get. Fine, whatever. I don't care. I care a lot. Oh well. It's not that important. Where the hell is this thing? There it is. Okay. Let's see. 70 miles an hour, 76. It is still going very fast. But it clears everything. Oh, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I want to keep it. If I lift this up, it won't be as fast. Sure. I could put brakes. Brakes. Brakes are the worst. Um. Or I can just keep it. It's just a small section of intensity, right? Hold on. I need to know. This is important. This is the most important ride in the park right now. Comes down. Watch that fear. Hit an eight for a split second down to si I think it'll be fine. It wasn't that bad. I'm doing it. We're keeping it. You can't stop me. It's happening. I don't know if that hill's gonna be big enough. Sweet. Look at that, everyone. We're through King Donut already. Super easy. Too easy. 
All right, then we're going to bank downwards. Why? Because why not? Okay. We're going to get rid of the bank now. Eh. I feel like... I don't know. I guess that's what the smooth banking's for, but I was going to say, like... We should be able to make the track pieces longer. Maybe that's just me. Maybe I don't know what I'm doing. Maybe my coaster's just too crazy. Because I have to build this weird thing and then smooth all. And that's the way I make it look not super gross. A lot of times I don't do that. A lot of times I just let it look super gross. We're at 60 miles an hour. Yeah, we're going to need to do something here. This would be kind of cool. I don't know if it's going to have enough speed through there. I mean, it was going 60 miles an hour, but it just looked slow. I don't know why that's always the case. It always just looks slow. But it's going a lot faster than it looks. Let's find out. Because that'd be kind of cool. Goes, does the thing. Goes up. It's up 40 miles an hour. Yeah, it's fine. It's perfectly fine. We'll do a drop. That should clear that, right? I'm gonna go with, yeah. I have a feeling it will. Do a hill. Everyone loves hills. And if you don't, well, you're a liar. <laughs> oh, now our speed's gonna have to be here. I don't know, I feel like the ride's like done, but it's very short. <laughs> Short rides are okay. You know, you can have a short coaster. Who says you can't? Forty, fifty. It's still going fifty miles an hour. We still have a crap load of speed. It just—I don't know. Like I keep on saying, it just doesn't feel like we do. I don't know why. Like it seems like I should just bring it to the station and call it there. But I know we, I had. 50 miles an hour. That's a lot of miles an hour. Let's do another one of these things. Just kidding. The worst part is waiting for the thing to catch back up again. So we can look at the testing. I feel like that's what I spend most of my time doing. Just waiting for the car to show up and run through it. Alright. Uh, what can I do here? No, I don't want to do that after that hill. Could do a helix. Helixes always look weird. I don't know. They just look... I guess because they're just... They have this extra bit. Then, what if we do that hammer? Or whatever it's called. Is it a hammer? Over bank. No, I think there is a hammer something, though. A hammerhead. Hammerhead turn. Something like that. See, the problem here is it's going to run into itself. We don't want that. Where's the hammerhead thing? Is it a roll? Cut back. Can we make that even smaller? <laughs> that just doesn't look humanly possible. Hammerhead turn. Yeah, we're too close to the edge of the park. Cobra roll? Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Yeah, this is so weird. I think I've just accepted the fact that all my coasters are just dumb and don't make any sense. I'm okay with it. Okay, it loses a lot of... Sp Actually, it's still an 8. What the? A 10? And it didn't even... It barely made up that Cobra roll and it had a... T what the? Helixes are the worst. It doesn't even make it through the thing. Okay, screw you, Helix. Freaking stupid waste of a frick. Get the hell out of here. Worthless, absolutely worthless piece of track. Complete garbo. Never use Helixes. They are worthless in this game. Okay, just do it yourself. If you want a Helix, just turn, bank, angle downwards, 
It'll be way better than the custom-made, pre-made garbage Helix that they tried to sell you in this game. I feel very strongly about that. Anyway. Uh, let's see. What do I want to do here? I don't know what I want to do. I kind of liked what I had going for me there, and then the game was like, hmm, not today. And I'm like, damn. Let's put a hill. Everyone loves hills. Okay. We have to watch out for this thing. Yeah, I kind of hate this. Yeah, no, I super hate this. Get the hell out of here. Did not have a lot of speed. Yeah, it didn't have a lot of speed at the end of this, but it picked up a lot of it. Right, I want to go back this way. We do also have to watch out for the end of the ride because, you know, we have to keep that clear. It would be nice to start to go this way. Okay. Look at those numbers. Way better than that other garbage. Can we do something fun here? Something unique like a frickin' frick screw? Corkscrew? That's what it's called. Not a it's not a frick screw, it's a corkscrew. My bad. So that goes. Uh, yeah, that's weird. Yeah, that's better. <laughs> Isn't it great how I do that? I just... I motion which way it's going to be banking with my hand. It's called professionalism. Alright, we're going to turn a little bit that way. I hope that doesn't screw anything up. Because in order to get this corkscrew in... I don't think we're going to be able to... The angle's wrong for it. If I make it as small as possible, it might work, but... Hey, I don't want to do that. If I do that, it could work. I mean, it's kind of weird, but... Yeah, it's too close to that track now. Ah! It was almost perfect. Yeah, no, it's not going to work out at all. Damn, 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 damn. Corbra roll? Corbra roll? What the hell's that thing? Butterfly inversion? That sounds made up. Here's the hammerhead thing. That I also do not believe will work. It is fairly big. And we're going to run to the track if we make it that big. So we'd have to make it smaller. Uh, that could clear. Should we do it? I'm gonna do it. You can't stop me. Let's just see how much track we can cram in this one tiny spot. That's the goal. Okay, up the thingy it goes. Down the thingy it goes. Down the thingy it goes. Through the thingy. Over the thingy. Loops around the thingy. Goes through that thingy. Flips over the thingy. Alright. Drum roll. It doesn't make it. Of course it wasn't going to make it. Because for some reason, you can go from like 50 miles an hour to zero in like two seconds. Two feet of height. You can just freaking ruin everything. I'm ending this coaster. This coaster's bad. I want to do it. I want to do something here. See, this right here is just disgusting. We cannot bank that way. Because it straightens itself out and then into another freaking bank. And it's gross. You can't tell me this right here is not gross. If I smooth the bank... I can't even smooth the banking on it. No, we're not doing that. Ugh. What do I do? Besides panic. What I could do... Alright, we can try a cobra roll. So this is what's going to happen. We're going to straighten this out here. Creep forward a little bit. Drop the cobra roll. So we have plenty of room in here. Can I not make it... Wait, there it goes. I was going to say, should be able to make it smaller. It's probably going to need to be as small as possible. This still might not even work. There's a lot of track here. And then we're going to end the ride. I think that's the plan. Perfect. It's a flawless ride. It's the best ride. 10 out of 10 ride. Would ride again. Okay, does the thing. Goes through the thing. Flips over the thing. Here it comes, 47 miles an hour, 45, 44.
It goes from 44 miles an hour to zero and it gets no height. Okay, screw it. Screw this ride. I'm deleting the whole thing. Get it out of here. We don't want it anymore. Just delete it. Delete it all. No, we gotta figure out something to do here. However, I need to end this episode. Look at that, everyone. Where does time time go? Time just flies when you're building coasters for the 500th time. <laughs> anyway, thank you all for watching. Leave a like, share the video if you enjoyed. They helped a lot. Don't forget, name the Giga Coaster because I forgot. And uh, yeah, I hope to see you next time.